Hey everyone, how are we all doing? So today we're going to be reacting to something kind of different, something new on the channel. Um, it's called Philosophobia, and I think I might have it. I think it's basically kind of like a fear of the open water, I believe. I think it is, I could be completely wrong. Um, but yeah, we're going to react to some, this is some Philosophobia images with unsettling music. Um, I'm kind of interested to see what impact it has on me. So let's, uh, let's get into it. And also, if you've got any kind of weird phobias, or if you have this as well, um, yeah, let me know in the comments. Here we go, let's have a look at these. First off, this first one, horrible, horrible. I think, do you know what it is? It's all that blue bit around there. It's all this blueness, and it's the fact that this chain just vanishes. That's how deep it is. I just find it very, very scary. I'm not sure what it is. See this one, I wouldn't say as much. Maybe if I was in the water I might be a little bit more scared, but this one's not, it doesn't really scare me that much. This one is horrifying, and I'll tell you why. So this bit, this, I'm guessing it looks like some sort of wave or something. Um, the wave is petrifying, very, very petrifying, but it's this part here. It looks like it dips down into something, and I could imagine being in there would be the worst feeling ever, knowing that there's a massive wave about to hit you, and it's going to fly you underneath the water. That would be disgusting, it really would be disgusting. Not too affected by this one. I can imagine if you went in there, that'd be pretty bad. But just seeing it from this angle, don't really bother me. Looks kind of cool. Same again, not really. It's mainly this black bit. I can kind of understand why people might be scared of this. And I mean, if you was on that boat, it would be petrifying. It's probably helping out a lot that I'm actually just watching it from a video, sat in a chair. Um, but yeah, that they are massive. Is that like a, some sort of whale? That one doesn't really do much for me. It's mainly like what I would think is if I look down now where I would be. That's the that's the part that scares me. <clears throat> that is unbelievably scary. I I really don't like that. I think what it is, it's the size of the whole structure and how small these people are. And it just goes if you just look down there, it's just going straight down into just nothingness and you don't know what's down there. There's something, I, so there's another phobia where it's like a fear of big things, like big structures. Maybe that's like a, like a kind of like a crossover with this maybe. Um, like the same, if I go to the beach, which I hardly ever do because I hate the sea um, and I hate the sand. This reminds me of like kind of underneath a pier. I can never go underneath a pier because of the structure. It's the structure. It's these. There's something unsettling about these rods. I'm really not sure what it is though. Do you get what I'm saying? This one, not but that I don't really do much for me. Maybe it's because of the quality of it. I mean, it is a little unsettling. That one. It looks it looks amazing, but it's not really that. That's kind of um, that's off putting. I think it's just open water, a lot of open water. 
and especially in the dark as well when it's even like in the open water in the sea you couldn't see below you anyway so you wouldn't know what's down there but I mean in the dark as well the loneliness and oh not for me it's not for me <clears throat> yep same thing again with the waves I would not like to be down here these are these are bad quality images I might uh, next time I might like maybe go on a reddit or something see if I can find anything on there um, but yeah I really don't like these drop offs it's, it's, it's so scary because it feels like here it's like when you look under the water it'll probably be nice clear water you'll be able to see the, the, the sand at the bottom that's how nice it will be and how clear it will be but then this bit it's just disgusting see there's something about this one it's more the darkness than anything and looking where that probably is that reminds me of like somewhere in America um, there's lots there's like quite a few like street rivers that have like these kind of surrounding on the edges and crocodiles and stuff like that it's not it's not for me I did go on to I did go on I went over to America um, God, it was, it was probably about four or five, no, longer than that. I mean, it was probably like nearly 10 years ago, actually. Um, Jesus, that's a long time. 10 years ago, and we went on to, um, I think it was called the Shenandoah River. I think. It was through Virginia. And we went on to the Shenandoah River, and we went on there in kind of something like this but obviously a lot bigger um and that was scary because we we traveled so far down this river the weather it started thundering lightning um the current started picking up in it we was in the on the river for about four or five hours it was stupid like a crazy amount of time and then our rubber dinghies popped as well because we went over like some rocks um and then we had to, we eventually had to climb out onto something like this, which I hate anyway. I hate like bare feet on something like that because of spiders and snakes and all that stuff in America. Um, and it was just, it was just a, it started off as a really cool day. Oh, we're going to go into the water underneath, like we're going to go down this river, proper chill. But it turned out to be a very traumatic day. Things went bad. I have a big problem with this massive problem it's i think that's what i think it is the size knowing that this is going to propel a huge huge ship and how sig insignificant um, that is there that's i think that's what the issue is that doesn't really um that's not too bad maybe it's the 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 quality of the image yep same again that one doesn't seem too bad because i can't see the size of the ship with a, and there's no person next to it for me to see do you know what i mean <clears throat> this one is this like a some sort of shipwreck no not such there's loads of rocks that's not a shipwreck whatever this is maybe an old mine i don't mind in fact i like none i won't mind standing here where this little pole thing is and looking into it wouldn't go in there though would not go in there it's a fear of being tangled underneath what's underneath like when i was when i was in the like swim pools when i was a kid always petrified especially wave pools where they've got like the bars at the end where the waves start coming out they used to petrify me i would not go anywhere near them simply because i thought there was something behind the bars like a shark or something it was a, it's a stupid thing but yeah that's not too bad i mean i think it's more beautiful than anything 
yeah, same thing again. Say if I, I would feel if I was if I was on a boat here, I'd feel a lot more comfortable than being on a boat underneath that. Same thing with the structures under the water. That's it. Oh, it's not for me. Ah, it's not really doing anything for me. Not really affecting me too much. And that is... That's it. Um, yeah, this one do not really affect me too much. It looks more odd than anything. Um, it's a shark, I think. Um, but yeah, it's, it's not really doing anything for me. Not really getting that fear out of me. Um, but yeah, if you enjoyed it and you want me to react to some more stuff and make me feel really uncomfortable and put me in a bad situation, then like the video I guess, uh, subscribe if you are new to the channel, I'd really appreciate it, anything you want me to react to at all, anything at all, then um, put it in the comment section, also um, I've started streaming on Twitch most days, um, round about 10pm UK time, um, I'm streaming normally Daisy and then I'll stream, I'll stream Daisy and a few other games and then I'll do like a bit of a kind of watch along, um, just chill out, it's a good community over there. If you can come along, um, the link will be in, maybe in the description, maybe on my about page, probably in the description. I'll put a link in the description for my, um, for my Twitch and I hope I'll see you over there. Um, if you get anything else, let me out to you, let me know. And, uh, this was, this was an uncomfortable one today. I'll keep it that, uncomfortable. See you next one guys. Peace.